Is it in there? Yep. What are you gonna do with it? I figured I'd put it on my living room shelf, you know, as a nice reminder of our trip to hell. Seriously? No. I'm gonna use it to call the Undertaker out. I'm guessing he really wants this thing back. Why would you do that? You already beat him. But no one else knows that. If I want to earn the respect, pun intended, of the locker room and WWE universe, then I need to beat him again in front of an audience of actual living human beings. Now that I've had a week to come down off the Shango dust, I'm a little less sure about all this. So just be careful, okay? I will. And who knows, if I can lure him into a match, maybe it'll be so big my real parents will finally show up. Crazier things have happened this past week. Yeah. Maybe. Trey is in the ring with what appears to be the Undertaker's urn. I have no idea what's happening, but this should be good. You're probably wondering how I acquired this. But I'm gonna save those details for some other time, mainly because you probably wouldn't believe me. But long story short, I went through hell to get it, literally. So Undertaker, if you want a shot at taking this back, you'll have to face me at Survivor Series in a... Now come out here and accept my challenge. Come on, answer me. What's wrong? You too embarrassed to show your face after what I did to you in the plains of purgatory in front of your hordes of undead? I told you it was a crazy story. The Undertaker is here. This is unbelievable. We haven't seen the dead man in years. At Survivor Series, you will not survive, but you will rest in peace. Trey's name is on that tombstone. Trey looks like he might be regretting his decision to summon the Undertaker from the dark side. Nonetheless, I can't wait for Survivor Series. Me neither. It might be the last time we ever have to see Trey. Welcome to Survivor Series, where later tonight we have an epic Hell in a Cell match between Trey and the returning Undertaker. And if facing the Phenom wasn't intimidating enough, he's dead set on regaining possession of his urn that Trey somehow acquired. Well, Trey has a list that helps guide his career. Undertaker has a list too. Of superstars he's massacred in Hell in a Cell over the years. Tonight, Trey will be the latest name added to that list. The Phenom has arrived. The mythical. Immortal. The Phenom. And his opponent from Death Valley. Weighing in at 299 pounds. The The greatest winning streak in sports history. When the Undertaker went 21 and 0 at WrestleMania, it is a streak that will never, ever be duplicated. The Undertaker is one of, if not the most prolific performer in pay-per-view in WWE history. The man has won Royal Rumbles. He's won WWE Championships. And as you mentioned, Cole, the streak will never be matched.
you have to wonder, what does Trey have to gain in a match like this? While the risk is certainly high, so is the potential upside. I know it's unlikely, but if Trey could defeat The Undertaker, that would go a long way in solidifying his status as one of the top WWE superstars in recent memory. I think there's a better chance Saxton wins Commentator of the Year. You really think I have a shot this year? No, no, I sure don't. with their head. His offense is on point right now. Bottle that energy and he'd be a rich, rich man. Oh, incredible height. He evades the attack. Neck breaker. Undertaker looking mortal here. If he can hold the line here, he'll be in a good position. Tough spot to be in. And it's The Undertaker, able to break free. Close line! Off with their head. Wicked body shot. In the lead up to WrestleMania 34, we had no evidence of The Undertaker making an appearance, and despite desperate attempts by John Cena to bait him, the dead man remained in the darkness until the very last second. This is gonna be big. Look out! He's taken to the outside. Thank you once again for joining us at November's longest running sports entertainment event. This is Survivor Series. Big headbutt. Undertaker starting to look human here. Yeah, he needs to make an adjustment here. Ooh, what impact. Had it scouted. Recalling WrestleMania 34, Michael, you said The Undertaker waited to the last second. All the way from the top rope, the fist has been dropped. In the slam. It's a holiday tradition, and we're having so much fun at Survivor Series. Survivor Series, without a doubt, one of my favorite pay-per-views, and this one's been awesome so far. Oh, again! And he's heading back in. Uh-oh. Look at this! Uh-oh is right. Power bomb! He's executing on his plan perfectly. Great effort, but we'll see if he has any energy left later. Unbelievable. He's going for it all. Here we go. Good night. Oh, 
nasty impact. Oh, could this be it? What a maneuver! Wow, we might just be... That should do it right there. That was a very near fall. How'd he do that? Spike into the ring apron. Going all the way up. Incoming. He's stuck in the corner now. Wait a minute. Looking in command at the moment. He's definitely got all pistons firing right now. Stomping down. That'll rock you. Boom! <laughs> from the top turnbuckle. Look at this. Bringing it back between the ropes. This match has the potential of breaking down out here near the steel structure. Ooh, what impact. He's got him in a tough spot right on top of that table. Well, it's just about all over now. Oh, this is dangerous. Whoa! Crashing through that table. He goes for the cover. I don't know too many other guys that would have been able to kick out of that. Man, Undertaker was almost dead and buried, but has enough strength to kick out and battle on. A striking blow. Just ruthless. He might have been waiting on that one. Going for the head here. That's one you feel for a few days, Bo. That'll rock you. seen the Undertaker tap out, but it may happen here tonight. 
Oh, somehow he breaks it. He may have broken free Cole, but I assure you the damage has already been done. Close line over the top! Man. Here we go again. Oh, my! Is this what he needs for the win? Gotta make the save. He somehow did it! Trey has defied all eyes to defeat The Undertaker. This definitely quiets any doubts that people might have had about Trey's legitimacy. I'll admit it. I had those doubts, but what Trey did tonight was truly impressive. Maybe this guy's the real deal after all.